I feel like I earned something here. After obsessing over steps for no good reason for a while. Hello. Oh man, this one's gonna go on for a while, huh? Okay, light sources. I can't rotate you. So it starts on the right and goes that way. Is it this way? It goes somewhere else, but I can't see from the right angle. I mean, is there a crouch? I don't think there is. Oh man. Okay. There's the back panel. There must be a light control in here, right? There's one light in here. There's a weird wheel that I don't think does anything. No, it doesn't seem to be connected to anything either. There's a hole in the middle. Is that a mirror? Is that a... Oh, it's a... This is a mirror. Oh! Oh my god. So this loops all the way around, basically. Oops. Boom. There's a goddamn mirror on the floor. Okay, that's crazy. So, okay, I have to interpret this correctly then. So it's going towards the si It's going towards the top left. And then looping around the bottom. Oops, no, no, no. No. There we go. It's surprisingly hard to pick the right direction with a mouse when it's that many directions. Alright. Interesting. Can I see this one from here? Let's see, let's just try looking at it normally and see if that's valid. Maybe I have to go over here in the shadows? Oh, there's another mirror over here. Hello. So, bottom right across through the... Starts at the bottom right. Goes to the top left. Then to the bottom. Do boop. God damn. Okay. Uh. Where's the, there's the new one. They're getting. They're, are they gonna keep getting slightly more unconventional with the, how the reflections work here? Here we go. No. I can't see anything from here. I don't think. Yeah. Nope. Over here. How to... Is it right here? So that's the light source. So... I would think it'd have to be like right here. Oh, is there a reflection right on the ground in front of it? There is. Just a little hard to see. Apparently I don't, my shadow doesn't cause any problems though. So it starts on this left side, and it goes up. And then it makes a Pac-Man, basically. Alright. It does a Pac-Man on this top side. This might be a little bit hard to conceptualize. There we go. There we go. Oh, one more. That's gotta be this one in the corner, this light. Yeah, there we go. Gotta keep flipping into my head. So, starts on the top. Loops around to Pac-Man the bottom right. Shit. I lost it. <laughs> Top. And then goes left. To, to, to Pac-Man the bottom right. So it goes left, Pac-Man's the bottom right. Bam. This is really satisfying <laughs> to figure out. Alright. What's left? Oh, the door. the door's open now, isn't it? All right. Yeah. We're going a layer deeper now. Oh jeez. Yeah, this is this is going to keep going for a while, isn't it? So, you must be a light switch. What did I do? Oh, we're changing the water levels. 
Holy crap. We're changing the reflections. Okay, that's crazy. So we know that that one is... Do we know that one's bottom left, and then it lightning bolts across? So we're gonna... We're gonna basically want to start in the bottom left and make an N on that side over there. Apparently this just keeps going. Where's the switch? Wow, how big is this chamber? Oh, hello. So this one is... It starts on the top. It starts on the top and, and goes... Oh, I can do it... Can I do it from here? I can. I totally thought I'd be close to these things. What? Am I wrong? Oh, it starts on the bottom, my bad. And then goes left. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. And then this one zigzags across with an end shape. Got it. Oh, I should have been watching at this point, shouldn't I? Yep, don't have that one. Alright, do I flip the switch and then it comes back over? Oh, where is it? There you are. Oh, there's- there's an alternate one over here, isn't there? No? So that one has the Q-tip on top. That one's also on the top. Is there an opposite? Do I use the- oh. There we go. So now we keep an eye on this reflection from the other side, and that one over there, too. Try to figure out what's going on in both cases. A lot of screens. I don't see a reflection yet. Maybe I'll see it at top height? Do I have to be further back? Huh. Judging by the angle, I might have to be further back when that happens. That's why there's multiple layers there. Let's give that a shot. Man, this... <laughs> we're really getting a lot out of this mechanic, aren't in general, aren't we? Alright, so as it drops below, will I be able to see a smudge? Come on. Oh, I get a little I get a little glare over here. So maybe as I lower it I could get just the right view. It's a little iffy. It's a little iffy. We'll see how it goes. Quickly. Oh yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna get the angle here. Oh, wait. Come on. There we go. Looping all the way around. Okay. That's the side closest to me. When I'm on this perspective. Do -do 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 boom. Did I get that wrong? There we go, it's just backwards. There we go. So, by the way, I spent a long time staring at that one and I got tired. I went to sleep finally, ending my first session. This is me finally starting the second session. I only got to play this game once the day it came out. And uh, had to wait for the week, the work week to end before getting to come back to it. And I'm, I've just been jonesing to come back to this game all week. I'm really excited about this game. Just to lay, lay a few ground rules really quick because it's based on comments and stuff like that. Uh, as far as comments go, if you notice something like on the floor, like I walk past something and just don't notice it or something, definitely be like, oh yeah, time code, this part of the video, there's a thing, that looks important and leave it at that, but I don't want spoilers. So never tell me how to solve a puzzle. Never tell me if I walk past something that's the key to everything. Like, don't don't sit there and explain it to me, because I'm going to find it eventually. That's the goal of this, is my whole goal here is I'm going to go through this entire game. I, my plan is to get 100% completion, but do it without using any guides. So I'm not going to look stuff up, and I don't want anyone to spoil mechanics for me, because that's 
literally all of the gameplay in this game. If you know how to do, do every puzzle, then you just can go blah, 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 and beat the whole thing in like four hours, which is what was, which was Jonathan Blow's own time, for the record. It's like he said, like four or five hours or something, because he already knows all the solutions. And that's just not, that's not gameplay at some point. That's the answers at the end of a math book, and that's not interesting. But yeah, I might do plan on completing this game. I'll get I'll I'll get 100% completion as long as this game doesn't get into ter ter the Fez territory, because I think Fez needed you to know how to how to program basically at some point for some of those cubes. So if it doesn't get that that, that absurd and it's just like really crazy puzzles within the rules of the universe, I'll take those out. So that so we unlocked this one by doing that. And there's one more over here. This one's interesting. This last one actually moves up and down. Uh, with the water, apparently. Unless it's, like, up in the ceiling and that's just a reflection of it, which could be true, too. Is it, like, really high up in the ceiling? I can't really look in that direction, can I? I guess if I head over here... Do -do 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 -do. Nope. Yeah, I don't see it. Whoa, whoa, okay. Screen freaked out for a second there. You guys probably didn't even see that. Um... I think the actual... I think it's just the real panel. Yep. We'll, we'll deal with that at some point. But if you see me passing by secrets and stuff like that, I, I'll get back to them at some point. I'm, I plan on finding everything. So this is the next one over here. Try to find the best angle for... the light. It's a little tough. I'm trying to think of terms like, the light starts there and hits the panel. So what angle does it reflect on the water in... to then reflect... I mean, in this case, it's probably going to be across the entire room. Which would probably be a decent bet. So can I see it? It's reflection from here. Wait, the panel's down, isn't it? Right, the water's down. So we'll watch as the water comes back up, and see if that does it. Alright, so there it is down there. Oop, it's glowy. Ah, uh, I see it. There we go, I see it. Can I actually t touch that? No, I can't. All right. Um, here. Whoa, mouse is getting stuck. Why is that? Stop it. I think the, I think I may not be able to access it from that angle. That might not have even been the mouse. Oh, I can't click on it now, huh? Oh, the water actually stops you. Interesting. Interesting. Well, I, don't, I have the solution now. As long as I keep it in my head. So we'll just let you drain. Yeah, apparently the water stops you from clicking on the panel. It made me think that my mouse was flipping out and having a bad signal or something. There we go. Nope. Cancel. Start the bottom. There we go. And that goes through to the chamber in there, I assume? There's this guy, though. Ooh! I just saw it. Uh. Oh. Alright, we're gonna have to change the direction real quick. I just got to see that panel. Kind of stumbled into that solution right there. Alright, we'll go back and forth while it's going across. Oh, we're only gonna see part of it though, huh? From this angle. Let's see. Oh yeah, you only get this thin sliver, but it looks like it starts in the top corner. And shoots across. Which, I mean, that means it starts down here. Can I click on you from here? I guess there is a maximum range. I'll give it a quick shot to see if it works, but it probably won't. Oh, it starts here. Interesting. So it went like this, basically, I believe. Alright, we'll try one more. Shit, did I lose track of where, what I was doing again already? Um, like that? Come on. Nope. Not quite getting there. Need a better reflection. I'm surprised I can't see the smear at all on this angle. I'll probably move it up and down a few more times. Let's see if I- can I get any more from this side or can- I wonder if I can increase the light in this room somehow. Oh, this light probably gives you a separate, better angle on some of it. Can I see the reflection? Oh, the beam's in the way. How do I destroy this environment to get better beam access? This one's weird too, can I click on it? I can. But how do I get a reflection is what I'm wondering. Because it's sitting on top of the water. 
I don't think we have mirrors around. Did I open this door? Nope. So the big wiggly, this big panel seems to be what's hooked up to this door back here. Whereas I think the other stuff I, I did was hooked up to something else. Oh, did I just, oh. The panels I've done so far turned this light on specifically in the first place. So while I felt like I wasn't able to see that reflection before, from happenstance, I believe, I probably can only see it now because that light turned on. Because this one was blocked by the beam from even lighting on that, lining up on that thing in the first place. Okay. And due to that, since there's a light on that thing directly now, maybe I could even look at this thing from a specific angle, angle just to see the smear on it. Or maybe not. Anyway, I'm gonna, I'm gonna push the, uh, water up and down a few more times until I get a better idea of what I think the, uh, combination over there is. Okay, so it seems to only move over one. It seems to only move over by one. So, by which I mean that goes here, up, then over one, then down. No? What if it's doing something weirder over here where I can't see it yet? Like, maybe it goes this way? And then loops back to where I can see it? Because that's where I can start seeing it. I don't think I can see that middle part. No? Alright, let me stare at this a few more times. Oh wait, there's this other end over here. That's from the- that's- that's the blue light. They're- they're nice enough to color code the lights, white and blue. So standing somewhere else in the room must help me see what the part that the blue light can see. Right here, probably. Oh! Oh! Hang on a second. I believe I can see you, finally. There we go. What did that do, though? <laughs> what are you attached to? I assume you're attached to something. Huh. Did the light get any better in here? Can you move around somewhere new? At the moment, I don't necessarily know what that one accomplished. Huh. Maybe it'll become apparent later. Either way, I'm still working on, uh... Still working on getting the right angle for this blue light. Oh! There we go! It's a little tooth at the end. There we go. That made sense. I had to stand by the blue light to see the white light, so it makes sense that I have to stand by the white light to see the blue light. So, you start up here and you... Fang down over... One... Oop, oh, shit. Careful. It's not always easy to get the right 45 degree angles. There we go. Got it. That's a loud, satisfying sound. Don't know what you did, though. I got you solved. Are you attached to anything? Maybe that'll come up later. Or maybe... I almost wonder if solving that one somehow made that reflection easier to see or something. I'm, it might come up over time. We'll see. Hello, tunnel. I, def I definitely get just the right amount of the uh, broken and uh, uh, massive chalice vibe from the art style at times. Hello, are you a reflection? Light sources up here. You're not even illuminated, are you? Oh, maybe past here. You'll be hard to see in that direction. Hello. Who are you? Okay. Can't get past these beams. It's, it looks like a skillet of, of some kind, almost. I'm sure that'll be... It'll make more sense in a different context. Oh, hello. Ooh, I can almost... I can almost see that grating from here, but not quite. Oh, there we go. This one over there, and it does have an obvious thing, so it looks like bottom right. And across. Alright. Let's find the exact part where it turns. There we go. Starts here. And you're another one. It starts up top. Now they're messing with the they're messing with the concept of inverted uh, color, I mean inverted uh, reflection directions by having it curved. All right, so we'll, we'll, the main snake's the part we need to know now. 
Because, yeah, the, the reflection moves in the opposite direction that you move in, basically. Hello? Oh, up and down now. Okay. Let's see. Getting the right angle might be a little harder. Oh, the reflection. Right. So then the bottom half, it just loops around. They both snake to the side. Parallel to each other. On the third row. Yeah. So right here, they both move to the side by one. Looks like that's the starting point. So it loops around. I'll try to solve it standing right here. So, starts there. Seems to loop around. Ooh, I can actually see the grease. The greasy bit while I'm doing this part, which certainly makes tracing that part easier. Without having to flip it in my head. First try. Cool. What happened now? Is a switch? Oh, but we need to flip the other one first. Which is over here. So I, I need to solve this to do it. Huh. Huh. Does the shadow tell me anything? It's just some planks. The planks wouldn't reveal this, the puzzle, would they? Oh, hello. Even that one has a smear. Okay. Oh, these planks are in the way. Oh, I get it. I have to I have to walk over to the other side to solve it, but I have to memorize it based on this side. So, oh, that's clever. So, I have to re I have to reflect it in my mind based on this reflection, but then I also have to reflect it in my mind because I'm going to flip it horizontally. So, first I have to flip it vertically. So, Flipping it vertically, it would start here and go over, then to the top. But then it would staircase across by moving over, then down, then over, then down, then over, then down. All the way across to the point, and then... Let's see. Over, down, over, down, over, down. Yep, so that it has a pillar on each side, its sides, more or less. It's two staircases inverted, basically. Okay, so, and then it meets in the top. So, I just need to start in the middle, bottom, but go left when I go on this side. Yeah. Middle, bottom, left. Up to the top. Staircasing. Got it. You're a clever game. Okay, what's your deal, though? Need reflection. Don't know if can get reflection past... Let's see. Can I see it from back here? Huh. I, I need you. I need you in my mind. I need you solved. Wait, what's your deal? Why is this thing turned off? Oh. Oh, hello. This thing changes Co direction. That's a big deal. Up should be good, right? Towards the light. Oh, uh, it's probably something where I wanted to face a specific direction, though. Huh. Oh, there's also a light. You can also see the light down there to an extent. How far does it go? Oh, that far. You can actually see the mechanism on it. So I get the feeling I don't want to go all the Oop. There's the angle. Right here. Let's me see it. Then, um... Question is trying to see it at that angle from a but from the other reflection, perhaps, because it's a little hard to get the right glare. That's only on the on the top. And if I tilt it downward, it's gonna get harder to see, right? Yeah, it's only going off. Unless if I tilt it all the way, maybe it'll be easier to see the reflection based on the light coming from the reflection of the light? Could be. Oh, here it comes. Ah. Yep, tilting it down. Oh. Started to get it. I lost it. I may have missed part of my opportunity there. Get just the right spot and watch it. 
Oh, uh, does it just go across? It does just go across. And that is closest to the base going towards the center and across. So here. Gotcha. Alright. Take a rest, you. Oh, it doesn't stop. That's fine, I guess. There we go. That's this whole chamber solved. Yeah. Okay. Only a couple reflections stalled me a bit, but I got through it. When I transitioned over to this session, we, I had uh, 89 puzzles solved. Oh, this is the elevator we saw from the surface. So I've gone from 89 puzzles solved to however many I just added now. So uh, the, not, the, not, the good news is the save file when you load it actually tells you how far you are in the game. I don't think it tells you how many puzzles there are overall, but it tells you how far you are. Oh, it's a laser. Oh, that was a laser. Cool. I didn't know what to expect. That's a nice sense of finality. I've got to watch the full animation every time this happens because it's just really cool looking. If you watch my Soma series, you know that I really like watching weirdly articulate machines being rendered in video games. And then it powers up. There it goes! Laser number two. Oh! Laser number two does not look like it's pointing in the same direction. That's weird. Interesting. Interesting. Do I need to change its direction or do I need to go there? It could just be powering. It could just be powering a location. And maybe I need to go activate that spot. What's. The, I just noticed this thing. These are holes? Oh, maybe when I was underground, I could see down there, based on those. It feels like I wouldn't have been in that direction already, though. 